Jackson, uh, a really positive night for the Socceroos. How did you assess it? Yeah, obviously really satisfying. Um, a lot more attacking intent from us tonight, a lot more clinical in the final third. Obviously delighted for the boys making debuts and scoring debut goals. It's always a special night. Um, and you, I think you could see how happy, you know, even for Rolsey on Thursday and again tonight. Now um, we're so happy for the boys when they get to sh have these special moments. And um, yeah, really, especially the second half, uh, very, very good display. I saw you give uh, John Idale a big hug when he scored. A special relationship building there. Yeah, just Johnny's one of these one of these kids. He's um, you know like 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 everyone, just so grateful and so appreciative of the opportunity to be here. And um, you know he had to bide his time. Obviously, being with us the full Asian Cup, same as Yaz, and not having that opportunity. They've um, you know they've really had to be patient for that moment and. For him to score his first goal is, yeah, he had one moment he'll remember forever, I'm sure. He's playing in Germany where you are. How much uh, importance do you put on playing week in, week out at that level and, mm. and how it's helped him here tonight? Yeah, of course, playing regular games is, is important, but even just being in that environment and um, for your developments, it, it can be so crucial. And, um, you know, sometimes it's not always easy. You've got to you know slug it out in moments it's not always going to be out there for 90 minutes every week for for a lot of guys so um you know again he's had to be be patient for for these moments and um you know hopefully it's this is a a, a moment for him to kick on perfect record for the team now four games four wins you've secured qualification what does that mean yes yeah, great obviously it was the goal um secure qualification as quick as possible um, you know, we wanted to show more attacking intent, but also another clean sheet, which is which is important. Um, I know we had a sc scary moment with the shot off the bar, but other than that, I think we defended our box really well. Um, yeah, so all round, very pleased with the just general um, attitude from the players. We know we know it's frustrating. Um, you know, perform, you know, players and the antics and of course you know um, officiating as well you know some of the tackles were the one on Aiden's an absolutely abysmal tackle I've seen it back now and he's very very lucky that his foot's not planted when that tackle comes in so listen there's a lot of factors within the game and I think the players managed it very well we, you know in those moments we, we were able to gain composure and um, you know we came together and spoke a lot on the pitch as well which was very helpful. We saw another sign of your versatility tonight back in that number six role, yeah. a role you've played before, but yeah. most recently you've been playing a different role. How did you mm -hmm. enjoy that tonight? Yeah, a different um, role for me tonight. Um, I think definitely as much as a, you know, you're not going to see much Aaron Moy in, in me playing that position, but, you know, it's about controlling the game as um, and, you know, through awareness and, and leadership and trying to you know keep the game simple at times um i was a bit loose in in certain moments from always quite critical of my, my own performance but um yeah it was a job that needed to be done tonight and you know i'm glad that that we came away and especially a clean sheet when you're playing as a defensive defensive player and so good to play two games back to back at home but just uh, perhaps a word on now the logistics to get home and to play club football because a lot mm. of people don't realize what's required of you the players from this point on yeah so um literally we'll we'll go back to the hotel now have a quick bite to eat and then we're on a bus you know three hour bus to, to sydney straight to the airport on a plane at 6 a.m um to dubai and then i think we'll all touch down you know in europe and wednesday night wednesday night time and some of the boys have got games friday night um, that's the reality. It's it's not ideal. It's part of international football. It's um, you know it's a small well, I say it's a small sacrifice that we that you have to make, but we do it because we absolutely love being a part of this team. And um, you know I don't think there's many national teams out there where the players are so buzzing to come into camp. Not only just to obviously be a national team player, but just to see each other and be back amongst this uh, this group. It's it's a real joy, and you know. Um, you know, we'll even have, we'll have a laugh travelling back together tonight and then, you know, we'll catch up again in, in, a, in six weeks' time.